we're back at Tim's and we're here to try something new. So to say this item is new, I don't know. I don't know if they're that big D, but they're saying it's new because the bacon is new. Because the bacon is now maple flavored. I'm always skeptical when people mess with bacon. Because it's bacon! Exactly. So you can decide for yourself whether this is a new item or not. But Tim's has labeled it as new. So today, Big D, we're here to try the new maple bacon bagel belt at Tim Horton. Let's do this. Ah, let's go. Back at Tim Horton's, Big D. This sandwich, a bead sandwich? <laughs> no, it's not a bead sandwich. A bead last, bagel. Last few things we've had at Tim's though have been bead something. So what I did was we, like I said, we got the bagel belt, bacon, egg, lettuce, and tomato. And I got the maple bacon because it's new. And I also went with what was on the picture, which is the everything bagel. Here's your view, it looks good. Nice big chunk of egg, some bacon there. Two strips of bacon, a little tiny bit of maple smell. So big D, let's give this maple bacon belt a try. Toast it, bang! Check out our shirt that says toast it bang today. I'm getting a very subtle hint of a maple taste. I was about to say, it's very subtle. I think you need a lot more bacon to notice it. Mm, or a lot more maple sauce on the bacon. If they didn't tell me this was maple bacon, I just think it's regular bacon. Mm, it's very unnoticeable. Like it is there and you can tell it's there, but. I need to try a piece with it. Big piece. I don't know, man, I don't really taste much maple -y. taste. So Big D, we just tried the maple bacon bagel belt. What'd you think? It was good. The sandwich itself was good. I feel like it's just another cash grab yeah. from a fast food place. Change it in a subtle way, slap new on it, and we'll sell a lot in the first couple weeks and we'll make some money. So I don't know how to rate this, David. I love the sandwich, the sandwich is good. But there's no difference in it. There's never any difference in anything that any of these fast food places are putting out. I want something new, d Was it really actually that good though? Was it delicious? No, it was a normal yeah. belt. But I liked the breakfast belt in It was good. It was, it was okay. It didn't blow my socks off. No, it was good. Mine was dry even though it wasn't dry because there was no sauce on it. And the bacon, like, it was so subtle of a hint of a maple taste. You'd never know. Now, you'd difference. never know unless you knew like we knew we were trying the maple bacon, so we we noticed it. But if you didn't know you were trying maple bacon, you'd you wouldn't know, notice it. You'd never notice it. No. I'd probably give it a 3.3 out of 5. I'll give it a 2.5, like a passing grade, I guess you could say it's a little bit like 50%. But when you're talking about coming out as a new item, once again, it's, it's not really new and it's just something they're... Trying to get so much money yeah. as they can. It's like their mortgage is due and they're like, come on, bring something new, our mortgage is due. Go make some money. Anyways, guys, that's going to be it for today's video. If you liked the video, make sure to hit that like button. It helps us out a lot. If you really liked it, then hit subscribe if you're not already a subscriber. Check out our Patreon down below. And buy a t-shirt. Check out our new merch store down below on this video. We do sell t-shirts. We just got two new ones. Actually, me and Big D are wearing... Big D needs more bacon shirt. This is a brand new one. We also still have the classics, the Big D foodie friend, the nerdy newfie logo. So check those out right down below the video. There's a little merch store with all of our t-shirts there. So if you want a t-shirt, check that out as well. This has been the new Tim Hortons Maple Bacon Bagel Belt. As always, thanks for watching. Stay nerdy and have a great day. Ah, don't go to Tim Hortons.